Hello everybody, Flick here and welcome to the first part of a playthrough of Dark Souls 2, Scholar of the First Sin, on PC and I am joined by Good Rory. Morning. And we are both sitting on our character creation screens as you can see, uh, see I have remade Flick the Mage for this playthrough. Rory, what are you going as? I'm going dual wielding decks. May cause... God have mercy on our souls. Yep. Right, I'm starting. Is this oh. your true self? I'm pressing yes. Do it. We skipped the intro because they are identical. I'm going to skip that as well. The conversations here are identical to how they originally were. And now talking to the lady who sounds like Daphne from Frasier, who I will also fast forward because her dialogue is not changed. I keep forgetting to change the nose of the default face because it's really big. So you haven't looked into this version at all other than maybe my video? I've seen bits and pieces back when they were showing off stuff, but I've not really gone in-depth into what they've changed or anything. Good. I I've, know a few new item locations, but it's nothing of value to me. I've seen as far as the Lost Bastille, what was in my video, but other than yeah. that, I have not. Which I watched. So you've also seen? Yes. Hmm. And yeah, there was like the original preview screenshots and whatnot of stuff that's changed. I did see one thing that I'm looking forward to, look, look forwarding to happening. Look, looking forward to happening? Yeah, I can speak. Where are um, you from again? <laughs> who knows? But yeah, there is one thing that I'm looking forward to, but I don't know when it happens. So I'm probably not going to say until it happens. Okay. God, it takes a lot of punches to break that cart. Oh, so I have a status effect, and I don't know what that status effect is. I didn't oh. have it before. You might need to check your PC controls. Why? Every so often, for some reason, it starts the game with auto run or auto block on. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want that. Yeah. Where would that be? Key bindings? Or? It's in key bindings, but I have no idea what the binding is. Um, it does. It was doing this every so often whenever I started a new character on the last one. I don't know what for. I don't know if it's while you're typing your name out that if you just happen to hit the key. We set then, camera like, target lock, maybe? It could be. It, if it's Has it got a red box around it? Yeah. Yeah, it's one of the Hang auto on. like symbols. No, I pressed middle mouse and it didn't sort it. I brought up my gesture menu again. Yay. That's why she's controlled. Oh, the old bow. Hmm. Oh, lock guard M. But I don't have an M in my name. Why would that? I don't know. Did you hit an M? At there. I pre yeah, I pressed M and it got rid of it. Yeah. It, for some Weird. reason, sometimes it just randomly turns on right at the start. Hmm. Huh. So as we were saying before we started recording, we're both in kind of like Bloodborne mode, so we have to get used to yeah. being able to block again. Are you going through the tutorial, by the way? Um, I was waiting for you. I'm right. I'm at the very first gate. I haven't gone through yet. I'm going through now. Although, for the record, you actually can't do some of the tutorial just yet. Yeah. So you knew that. I knew you. What you say? You said in the bloody video. Oh no, I didn't. I actually told you beforehand, didn't I? I think you told me beforehand, and then you also said in the video. Uh, because I wanted to double check whether it yes. was something that was added in the free patch or something that was brand new. I didn't actually realise it was entirely brand new. Because I actually thought the free patch had added this. No, from what I remember playing of the free patch, it was basically just the new, some of the new, adding the scholar in. I've never even seen. I didn't bother playing the patch because I knew I'd be playing this version sooner yeah. or later. So um, I can pretty much tell you you will see the scholar, but I won't say when it's going to happen. Okay, okay. It's Garen, you cannot miss it. Oh, how do you backstab in this game again? You have to get behind them. Remember, is it heavy attack or light attack? Light attack. I I pressed light attack there. Why didn't I backstab him? Can you not do it with your offhand weapon? Not with your offhand. That would be why it didn't work then. Sorry, I'm a mage, but I'm just using a dagger in my offhand. Big would want to fight about it. I just tried to roll through that guy's arrow and it didn't work. No, no. It didn't work for me either. Why did I do it right after you said it? I need to get used to the timings on this. We should also point out that they never fixed the little hiccup in the game where if you're in 60 FPS, weapons degrade twice as fast because there's yeah. double the frames. I guess because they couldn't work out how. You see, there's an easy way to patch this to fix that. Half durability. Just Half double it and the then durability, it... double the durability of everything. Yeah, that would work everything too, yeah. degrades at the same speed. Or, you know, just add like a 50% buff because then it compensates. Yeah, or do something. But interestingly, I noticed that my weapons were degrading very fast in the PS4 version, so presumably that is running at 60 frames per second, although there's no so way for me to tell. what they've done is rather than fix a bug, they've given it to everything. It would seem so, yeah. Next-gen consoles, congratulations. 
Although, don't use my video as a indication of that because it was in 30 frames. This will be in 60 frames. Also, this seems to have V-Sync issues, which the PS4 version did not. Give us smooth. I'll give you something smooth, all right. Let's see. Uh, no, not discard. Right, Jesus has got on my side. Yeah, let's see who gets the better thing out of this. Okay, I'm ready to pick up when you are. I am as well. I got the same thing I got in the PS4 version. What'd you get? White ring. Fuck. I got Titan Slab. Oh, you got much better than me. I got much better than you, but it's not. I can't use it. Freaking ages. Yeah, but now you don't need to farm one more of them. All right, so I'm into the second Thanks tutorial bit now. Oh, you're doing all of them. I'm doing. Well, no, you can only do the first oh. two. Are you actually doing? I was going to leave the second one because I never bother with it. I'm going to do it. There's a uh, amber herb in it for me, and I need those. Oh yeah, you. Oh yeah, you're a wizard, aren't you? I keep forgetting that. I'm not a wizard. I'm a mage. There's a difference. Wizards are ponces. Whatever you say, flick the wizard. No, I also didn't call myself Flick the Mage. I just opted. To, oh, how do you jump in this game again? Oh yeah, I was oh, just really? gonna. I was gonna run and press the button. L three. Yeah, very so nearly I, just press the sprint button, expecting to jump. That. Silly Bloodborne. Classic, classic Bloodborne and Dark Souls all the way. Why didn't they keep the same jumping or put jump on a different button? It actually does make it awkward to jump in Bloodborne sometimes. I noticed having to press down on the same button as sprint. Yep, and so, it's got me killed probably once as well. Hmm. Have you finished it without spoilers? Um, I can finish it. I'm choosing not to because I remembered there was a door that I forgot to open and now I can. I see. I think I'm very close. And now I've decided that I should probably do all the like bonus dungeon, the randomly generated dungeon, because when you do one of them, you get another chalice for another one. Oh, that's how you get more. That explains why I don't yeah. have them. You need to actually do them to get more for them. A petrified man. The other reason to do this is because we can get the invasion thingy to invade nice and early. Yeah. Oh, I get it. I keep forgetting. Oh, I don't like that. What don't you like? Um, you can look into the area you're not allowed to go into yet. Yes, I know. Ben, what Ooh. did you see? I don't like I remember you guys. Do you remember what they're called? Basilisks? Yes. I also remember that the big eyes aren't their eyes. What, is their arses? No, it's, they're there for show. Really? Yeah, they're not real eyes. You know the ones that have got like the really small eyes in the other area? Hmm. That's what they actually look like. They've got like really small eyes under the, above the mouth. That's gross. Yeah, the big eyes are just to scare you off. It works. Yeah. Also, just like the last time, I've got to put down my message right at the door. What message? Praise the sun, therefore praise the sun. Oh, I'm going to copy you. <laughs> this time you will not steal all the glory of the praising the sun. Uh, Once I remember how to do it. <laughs> crap, I've Yay, all the messages! Ah, oh, there we go. They've all just loaded in after I left the tutorial area. It's a medulla! I'm going to place it, where would you probably have placed it? A little bit further back, maybe, so I'll put it right here. Also, I managed uh, to get a decent message in Bloodborne, too. Oh, god damn it. Well, I've never seen any of them, I play offline. <laughs> how do I write a message in this again? I can't remember. In the menu, you, you got to pause and go to a message. Oh, uh, yes. Oh, they've had an effect once you've written, so you can actually tell the difference. Oh, nice. I want to see it. Where is Praise the Sun? In Musings? Yeah, That's yeah. what I thought. Also... Not uh, capitalised. I told I told Ciara something bad that happened in Bloodborne. There is no horse in the messages. Oh, that is yeah. disappointing. The closest you can get to is Beast. Wait, do you mean the like the stuff lifting off the message? Yeah. That was always there for your own messages. It wasn't, it wasn't always that. It wasn't that as... Yeah, I'm fairly certain it was always that profound. Oh look, people have already died in the area nope. here. Have people been... have already killed themselves by jumping off the thing. It's possible when you're going for the dreaded binoculars. Just go from the bit that I actually want you to. Exactly. Which I've already I've already gone for the binoculars. But I got the morning star and chime first, but yeah. Binoculars all the way. Yep. Now I need two though, so that I can do the binoculars dance. Oh yeah, but I don't think that's happening anytime soon. Oh yeah, that's New Game Plus only, isn't it, to get another yeah. set? God I damn. Unless you can steal someone else's. Unless they put another set in. Although, why would they? Because binoculars are great. I know they're great, but... I am the next monarch. Bow down. I don't want to read the message. I hope everybody doesn't mind them fast-forwarding the 
dialogue, but I've heard it so many yeah, times now. It, it's it's old dialogue. They've not changed any of it. No, this is all the same. Certainly up to everything I heard was also the same. Oh, but I don't want to level up. I just want to talk to you enough so you give me the best flask. Remember out. to rest to get your durability back as well. Yep. And also the Estus flask in the well is still there. Yes. Now I need to talk to the way of the blue guy so I can get a ring. And oh get yeah, I should probably do that. Okay. No, I was going to do it just for the safety in case there's already blue sentinels. Not that it ever bloody I works. Didn't, but... It didn't work. But now you can have more people. Yeah, it still doesn't work. Oh. <laughs> it relies you being attacked by someone and one of that covered, one of the other covenant being in the area at the same time you are being attacked. There could be a lot of people playing. How many do you think actually stay with the? Well, actually, right now the game isn't out in America. Well, no, no, it's not out on consoles, but the console servers are segregated from the PC ones. Yes. But so are the consoles, so PS4 yes. servers are different to Xbox ones. Also, we are segregated from the other PC version. Yeah, the DX9 no, version. No, because reasons. Yeah, so they've taken what could already be a moderately sized player base. Well, actually, no, the first game sold really How? well. How? How? How I just looked at the worldwide death count. Oh, I'm going to do it as well. 21,000. Out a day. Just because people get press copies doesn't mean they're good at the game. And like usual, the message on the back of the statue is gone. Oh, this guy just goes on and on. Yeah, I nope. thought that was supposed to tell you about the first DLC. It does, but no, it told you about each DLC as it came out. So now it just doesn't do anything because they're yeah, all out. Yeah, now it out. doesn't do anything. Usually if there's any secret messages they want to stick in, they stick it on the back of there. Uh, yeah, I'll join the way of the blue. Give me that achievement. Give me that sweet achievement. But it is nice now that the console version looks identical to the PC version. Yeah. Without the V-Sync, actually, so technically the console version is now better. Yeah, but there's no modding. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I'll put the ring on, why not? Oh yeah, I also have the white ring. Well, yeah, sure, why not? I'll look, look like, I'll look like a co-op player just for the hell of it. What you need to do then is get the ring that makes you look like a human. And then wear that at the same time as the white yeah. ring. So then you'll be a human pretending to be a phantom pretending to be a human. Also, I was blathering so much I forgot to actually get the Estus Blast Yard. I'm just going to the Victory Stone to pretend to join their Covenant just so it'll give me the achievement. Oh, for goodness sake. Hey, I need to work on those achievements again. Concentrate on Bloodborne. I, thought I, I might have almost have all the achievements on Bloodborne soon. Nerd. Hey. Have you done much co-op and PvP in that? I've done a little bit of co-op and I've done two PvP fights. Is it essentially the same? Practically, only it's a little bit more annoying because from which perspective? Well, perspective in when you co-op with someone, mm. rather than like picking up a sign, you ring a bell, and anyone that's ringing the opposite bell can be summoned into your world. So you don't get to pick who you're summoning in; it will randomly pick from the lot that you can get access to. So, in other words, there's no way to deliberately make sure you get your friend in. There is because you can add in a code. Ah. If your friend has that code locked in, then it will only summon people with that code. I like that. So That's a good idea. If you're trying to get people that you want to get in, you can. That's good. The only thing is, it randomly summons them in somewhere. In the so, area you're in, though? Yes. When some I've areas are actually leave. quite big. Yeah, I've had a person leave on me because they couldn't find me. Hmm. What about when you want to join a random dungeon, though? Presumably you both start at the start then. I have no idea. I've not bothered trying to summon them. Oh, okay. Those. Also, I'll check with the cat see if she still has the ring. Oh yeah, Shala Qua, whatever her name is. Roll through the door. By the way, people listening, this first part will probably be a little bit short just so we can get out there to let people know we're doing the playthrough. Please show your support, leave comments, likes, etc. to let us know that you want to see it. Right now it's going to be every other day because I'm focusing on Bloodborne and such like. Um, she still does have the ring by the way. How much is 5, it? 5,500. This is a lie. 5,500, right, so... Well, we don't really need to worry about co-op until, like, No Man's Wharf, so we don't need to worry about farming up the souls just yet. Plus, I'm, oh, it's still got soul memory, that's... I keep forgetting that, I think. For a new game, that shouldn't ever matter. Not really, but if it gets into the point where we want to farm for anything, we're probably, we're probably gonna screw up the soul memory stuff. We would never get far enough apart that it would matter with the ring on. The ring's... Oh, yeah, the ring... Huge... Yeah. Also, Without the ring, then, maybe. I keep forgetting as well that the, the weaker soapstone has a wider range. Does it? Yeah, it has a wider range, but you don't last as long. Oh yeah, it's 15 minutes regardless of what you do, right? Yeah. 
but I think as a whole, I think it's a good couple of thousand soul memory apart per rank. So are you in Forest Fallen Giant yet? No, I've been making sure I pick up everything that's in this area first. I see. Well, I'm just entering it now. Watch the bonfire one more time, just in case. To see what drops from the sky and kills me for no reason. Yeah, just you wait for it. Oh, right, yeah. I forgot he was there. <laughs> it's annoying. I need the key to the bloody workshop for it so I can get the actual weapons I want to use. I need to give myself a shield so I can start parrying. Oh, yeah, you have the obsession of having to parry everything in this game. I keep a gunning. I don't even though need... you're a wizard. Yeah, and even, even though I can use a gun to do it in Bloodborne, yeah, I still don't really do it that much in that. It's just that I don't look at a gun and think, yes, I will use this to parry. Well, yeah, that's that's obviously the main use of a gun. I wish I was better at it. I, off camera, when I can spend more time working out when you're supposed to do it, I think I'll get better at it. The timing on it seems to be iffy depending on the gun you're using as well. Mm. Like, I've swapped out to a pistol currently, and... It did look like the pistol was easier to do it with. Well, it feels like the closer they are, the easier it is with the shotgun. I've done it point blank tons of times. Yeah, it also apparently it also feels like it, you have to hit the head, so if you don't hit the head, it screws up. All right, well, that could be a thing. But you can't individually target unless it's specific. Yes, and that's the problem. That arrow looked like it was going in slow motion. Oh no, piggy. Big piggy cyclops. Beautiful cyclops, I think you'll find. I don't want him to punch me. He's actually non-aggressive. Well, actually, I've never walked like right up into his face, so I suggest you don't either, but if you keep a reasonable distance away from him, he will ignore you. I miss the speed of Bloodborne. I do like the frenzy speed of it, yeah. Yeah. I like this combat style as well, though. Also, we should probably talk about this game more than the other game we're playing, although we don't really have the chance to talk about that yeah, one. There's, so. there's nothing really to talk about so far because we've not... Nothing really new has happened what yet. What about the hippo? It's a hippo. Or the cyclops, whatever people call, to call him. He's a hippo. Don't make fun of his weight. Also, I did just try and hold my heavy attack to get a stronger one. Then. Nice. <laughs> oh, it's great. Well, if you can get up the ladder in the tree, you should start noticing significant changes to the enemy design of this area. Hit you. Watch this guy's pathing go crazy. And now you. Poor dagger is going to be broken by the end of this. Use your magics. I have too good to use syndrome when I only have one soul arrow equipped. I want like four of them equipped, so I have forty of them again. You need. You need, need to use all of them. Although, to be honest, with the durability of the weapons as they are, it, it probably is more cost-effective to just use them in magic. What was I even trying to do there? Oh, I've, I was thinking I had a gun in my other hand, that's what. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is going to get so bad when we keep trying to do things that blood, the Bloodborne and it's this. I'm trying to remember what killed me in as much as I played of this on the PS4. I can't remember where I first died. Hmm, it wasn't a boss. I don't think it was fall damage, but I think it just got ganked. Oh, now I remember, yeah, where Rosabeth is. The people that come out when you pull the switch where she was. I got stuck in a corner and they ganked me. Time to kill all these suspicious looking lying down people. Nah, they're dead, it's fine. Oh yeah. Oh no, he got up. No, you're imagining things. It's crazy talk. <laughs> the advantages of being a mage sometimes. I'm hitting the guy up the top. Nom, nom, nom. He was alive all along, oh no! I'm trying to, I'm forgetting who I killed and who I haven't killed now. I haven't killed you. I think these guys also do a bit less damage. To get you ready for the... I think the balance at the start of the game is a bit more of a steady curve. And as yeah, a result, I think these do less damage. Because I'm a mage wearing crappy mage armor, and they're not doing that much damage to me. And I noticed that when I was wearing... Ooh, I started as the knight on the PS4 version, and they weren't doing anything at all. 
Oh, a little one I forgot. I kind of want to go up there to kill him, but... I've only got nine, eight soul arrows left. What will I do? Go to the bonfire that's close by. I intend to. I also have those amber herbs I earned from the tutorial that was so worthwhile. Yeah, but you don't want to waste those yet. That's probably a good point. Stop throwing firebombs at them. Just snipe them with your magic that you don't have. Also, my... Ah, oh God. Freaking durability. I miss Bloodborne durability. I've never had that be an issue ever in that game. Nope. Most weapons start with like 200 durability, that's why. Mm. Rather than 50. That's a lot of bloodstains for one era. What the hell have people been doing here? Um, Fighting and then dying. Oh. Don't punch me in the head, you dick. <laughs> Didn't even have a weapon. I'm getting a lot of the hollow inventory gloves. So you get ready for those fight fighting with them gloves. I can't even remember what's up here. Um, a sandwich. Did you remember about the item to the right as you go up the top of that area? It's a soul of a nameless soldier! Ah, you fell off this. Ooh, bandit's knife. Is that better than the starting dagger? I fell off that, but I didn't take any damage because I fell off in the right place. Yeah, it does bleed and it's more damaging. Oh, and I can't use oh, it because bandit's I don't knife. have dex. Oh yeah, you need dex. Blech, I'm not getting dex on my mage. You should have got dex. If you, if you if it was Dark Souls 1, you'd be getting dex. That's because everybody got dex in that game. Well, no, also for some reason in Dark Souls 1, cast speed was linked to dexterity. Yeah, exactly. So everybody, regardless of what build, had to get dex. Which is silly. Yes, <laughs> yes it is. Yeah, dex is amazing. Yay, hallelujah, infantry gloves. Yeah, they, they're dropping a lot of them. I've had one. Oh. We already see who's got the better drop rate so far. My discovery always, rate is through the roof. I've already broken my bloody sword. Good job. I'm on to my second knife. <laughs> and I guess we'll stop this first part when I get to the bonfire up ahead. I need to fight through this bit first. Just need to get used to doing that jump again. Oh yeah, short sword. Replace my short sword with a different short sword. I'll re-up that message. They are factually correct. Nah, that's not true. They can't be factually correct in this. Wait, where are you going, buddy? Oi, oi, oi! Where are the... Ah, oh, not enough to kill you. Oh, hello. I'm not entirely sure where you came from. I forgot about heavy attacks. I'm making better use of them now. Behind me, just in case. Wooden bolts, time 20. I'll need them. Maybe. Nah, Maybe. no one uses crossbows. That's not true. Maybe. Name how many, cross how many crossbows do you think are actually usable in this game? Well, at the start of the game, they're good for pulling when you're a maid. Uh, sorry, a melee guy. I just get throwing daggers the cheaper. No, I mean before you can even get them. You find I've it for got, free. Like, two. Who the hell do you already have two? Because you pick them up. From where? People drop them. You're telling filthy lies. I would never do that. We're ahead and then therefore try butthole message on that <laughs> body there. <laughs> uh, Don't encourage Total them, Rory. City. They're great. Oh, that you just love it. And this is the PC Master Race comments. Yep. This is why with the PC Master Race is a thing. Yeah, see, they gave that guy there a knife. I'm sure he used to have an axe and therefore did more damage. The guy who kind of ambushes if you go after the archer at the top of the stairs. Maybe I'm wrong. You also can get sniped by the archer up there this time. People watching Ow. me. Yeah, you just firebomb yourself, buddy. That's fine. Oh, he actually fell off. Ha! <laughs> I miss ragdolls. Well, they still ragdoll. Not much. They disappear. They, they don't ragdoll as much as in Bloodborne, no. I want to roll into someone, have, have my feet catch them and flip them over my Are head. Are actually going to chase me? Do the medium tier knights climb ladders? Um, I think any humanoid can. Eh, he doesn't seem to be wanting to bother. 
He just comes around the corner now, I believe. Yeah, there he comes. Yeah, well, I luckily, I'm invincible while I'm in this door. Actually, no, I'm not. Never mind. No, this ain't Bloodborne, remember? Yeah. I already see a small summoning stone. I need more stamina. No, no, you're a mage. Mages don't need no stamina. I've got no magic left. Mages need more magic, is that what you're saying? Well, anyway, I got to the first bonfire, how about you? Um, just the ladder. Right, so you're basically there. So in that case, I shall leave off here. Please stay tuned for more. And Well, I might get the second part up a bit faster than the planned schedule. But anyway, I'll see you goodbye for now, and Rory can say whatever he likes. Probably something gibberish, knowing me. Yeah. So, ta-ta for now. Cool.